I'm Bob Price and I'm attending the Winter Leadership Conference here at the American Bankruptcy Institute in Tucson, Arizona. I had to remember where I am today. And Sam Giordano, who is the Executive Director of the ABI, thank you for taking time to talk to us a little bit. I'd like you to educate our readers and viewers here about, about what the American Bankruptcy Institute is and what you do and, and what's going on here with this conference today. Well, welcome to uh, Tucson and the Winter Leadership Conference. The American Bankers Institute is a 13,000 member professional association uh, made up of individuals who are involved in the bankruptcy process, uh, representing debtors or creditors in individual and corporate cases. Uh, they represent both, uh, both sides uh, of the issue. Uh, and so ABI is involved in continuing legal education. This conference uh, is two days worth of programming about current developments in the law. Uh, around the country uh, uh, in bankruptcy. Uh, we're also involved at, on a policy level uh, with our bankruptcy commission to study the reform of Chapter 11. We're a Washington-based organization, so we have always had a policy orientation. We don't take advocacy positions in front of Congress. We don't lobby uh, one side or the other uh, because our members are very diverse. Um, as I mentioned, they represent both uh, creditors and debtors in business and consumer cases. I noticed a lot of diversity here in talking with, uh, we've talked with judges and attorneys and a uh, member from the Justice Department right. here today with the trustees, and it, it seems that you have a, a, quite a wide diversity of people here and interests going on. Yeah, absolutely, Bob. We were the, uh, sort of the umbrella organization for every interest that's involved in the bankruptcy process. Mm -hmm. uh, bankruptcy, particularly in the corporate um, environment, is really a kind of a, a large negotiation um, of interest to try to maximize uh, value in the case uh, to produce the best uh, outcome of recoveries to all of the parties involved. And to have that, you've got to have all of the different representatives uh, around the table um, at your events, and that's what the ABI membership is, very different. Now, today you had a commission hearing for the bankruptcy reform issue that's going right. on, and this is going to be continuing for couple more years, I think. That's right. That's right. Yeah, it's a two-year process um, funded by, uh, uh, by the ABI. Uh, it's intended to uh, comprehensively uh, study uh, Chapter 11, which is the, the basic corporate reorganization law in the United States, uh, which is about uh, 40 years old. Uh, the law was uh, passed by Congress in 1978, and most of its original architects, a couple of whom are actually on this commission, uh, have identified that that's, that's about the shelf life. Um, based on all of the changes in the economy and, and economic structures that, uh, that have evolved uh, since then. And so because of that, the idea is that it's really time for a fresh look, a reconsideration of the law's purposes and how well they're still being met uh, in, in the reality of, of today's modern Chapter 11. So the Commission's work product really at this point is involved in outreach uh, to try to uh, involve as many people in the restructuring community as possible to get their views about how current law is uh, working or not working, and then to make suggestions for reform that can then be presented uh, to Congress uh, when the time comes. So the hearing we held today uh, looked very much like a congressional field hearing with, with witnesses and a transcript and, and a record being established um, that, uh, that can inform uh, the reform process. And I noticed today in listening to this commission and the one in San Diego that I attended last month that uh, there's a lot of back and forth between the panel and the witnesses. It's, it's not like preaching to the choir kind right. of thing at all. It, there's some real debate going on here. That's right. People have strong opinions about um, uh, ways the law should be reformed. And so those uh, impressions uh, are being challenged by the commissioners so that at the end of the day, we have a, a rich discussion and a more informed uh, process that we can then recommend uh, in terms of uh, uh, recommendations to Congress. I, I've, I've noticed a lot of changes going on just in, in the opinions of people as we're, we're going through this process. A lot of debate, uh, particularly around the issues today of the uh, representation of unsecured creditors right. and, and things like that. It, it seems that it's a very spirited debate. Where can people who are interested in this, you know, I've just started looking at this issue on for some other reasons, but uh, where can people who are interested in looking at what's going on with the bankruptcy issues get more information? Well, one place to start is the uh, commission's website. Uh, it's commission.abi.org. 
Uh, there you'll find uh, all of the record of the public hearings that have been held to date. There have been six uh, held around the country so far. Uh, all of the transcripts are available. Uh, all of the um, actual testimony, the live and recorded testimony, is uh, available. So you can get a sense of, of the dynamic of the debate uh, that is just uh, beginning. And um, it's a great way to inform yourself about sort of current thinking about uh, Chapter 11 today. And you don't have to attend the commission to hear, see it going Do on not. live. Yeah, there are, all of the hearings are streamed live over the internet. We streamed live today uh, here in Tucson. Um, uh, and and there, again, there's a permanent record there um, uh, with an edited transcript that is available for the public. In addition to people who are already in the, the legal profession, is there information available for law students and things like that as well? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, again, the process is uh, designed to be as transparent as possible. Uh, so the commission site is open to everyone. It's not uh, limited to ABI members. It's all publicly available. Um, as are many of the materials on ABI's own website, abi.org. Uh, there you can find uh, daily news about uh, things happening in the bankruptcy world from major cases that you read about in the newspaper uh, to other issues that um, affect individual debtors, for example. Um, and again, all of that is publicly available in our, in our newsroom section. Uh, which is a very rich uh, source of information about what's going on in current developments in bankruptcy. Well, unfortunately, bankruptcy is a much bigger issue in this country right now than we wish it was. Sure. And uh, hopefully things will change over the next few years to make it less so. But I uh, appreciate the work that you're doing with the ABI in and, and looking for what's right and what's wrong in, in the current bankruptcy laws and how to make it better process for everybody. Thank you very much for being here.